this video is going to be a shoe haul from Christian Louboutin. And that's how, I guess that's how you pronounce it, Louboutin, Louboutin. You know what I'm talking about. And Chanel, and the first thing I'm going to show you is these right here. And um, they just black with um, like some silver chains around them. That's what they look like. And I got these from Neiman's. And I was covering up the price because I just was. If you're interested in how much they was, you know what? Okay. There you go. So, this is what kind they are. And you can pause it if you're interested in this shoe. And it came in the bag. I haven't worn these yet. <clears throat> like I said, I've been out of town, and this shoe is so freaking comfortable. I tried it on in the store, and they, they're black leather, and I love the way this shoe feels. I love the way it fit, and it has the two C's right here, and just the Chanel on the bottom, and this size is a 40. I normally get a 39 or something like that, but... The shoes, I guess they run small or some. I think in um, um, women's in a, in US it's an eight and a half. I don't know, I'm not for sure, but I'm gonna pull the other shoe out real quick. They both came nicely packaged in this bag, and I went to the store and got these, so they wasn't shipped in the mail. But they are comfortable, very very comfortable. So it's those. But this right here came in the mail, and um, this the Christian Louboutins, Louboutins, I even want to pronounce it, everybody pronouncing them in their own little certain way, and these are some tennis shoes, and they are Rancis Women Flat Python shoes, made out of snake skin, and I like these shoes, so I ordered them. And they came in a bag as well. Each one of these shoes came in a bag. And this is what the shoe looks like. So I thought these would be some nice kicks for the summer. And then it comes with the red bottom as well. Like the heels. And I'm going to take both of them out so you guys can see them. This is that, and it has a little logo on the side, right here, on each shoe. So, this is both of those. Wait a minute, yeah, that's the right. And they look like a snake head. <laughs> the toe of them do. So, they call Death Booty 160 Shiny Kel. So, what these look like they weren't in a bag but um i think i'll wear these when it start to get cold and has a little red sole on the bottom and they made out of leather and this is what the shoe is like this is both of the shoes so i'm anxious to wear these as well but for now, they'll just get put in the top of the closet. And I'm going to go ahead and show y'all these. These are called Bianca 120 Padding the Calf. Padding the Calf. And I've been wearing these. And these shoes are freaking comfortable. They're just a new color. I didn't like the other ones, the pointy toe. Mm -mm. No, I ain't like them. But I have been wearing these. I've worn them maybe five, six times. And that's what the bottom of the shoe do when you wear them. The guy said it does that because it's real leather. But from here on back, it doesn't, like, mess up. And you take this back to Neiman's and he fix it. I just haven't took them back yet because I don't see what's the use because I'm still going to be walking on them, so... Yeah, it's not that they tore up or they regular or nothing like that. That's just 
how they do because it's actual leather on the bottom of the shoe. So yeah, but the rest of it you don't have to worry about that messing up. I'm gonna put that and I got another black pair Bianca black because I like the way those shoes look and feel and how comfortable they are I don't think I'll be getting no more shoes from them for a minute because I don't like those other shoes because I'm telling y'all take it from me they hurt your feet all that money and then you got to be walking uncomfortable, sweetheart. No, ma'am. You see other people on them, and I'm trust me, they feet hurt. The guy was like, it's painful to be beautiful. It's pounds like shit. You can have that pain. But anyway, these are those. And like I said, I haven't walked on these. I haven't even put my feet in them. So, um, yeah, I wanted a pair of black ones as well. Now, y'all, if y'all want to buy some of these, spend you some money on one pair of these, I strongly recommend these or some sandals or something. Them other ones, the pointy toe, um, girl, I'm trying to tell y'all, y'all going to be like me and y'all going to take them back because, mm -mm. and it wasn't that they was like, I mean, I don't know how to explain it. They just hurt your feet. And, so, and they all come with a little dust bag. The, the heels came with one dust bag. So, and then the last two things that I got from them was two wallets <clears throat> and one is a river long wallet and the other one is a Pantone wallet. Calf spikes Nick Chevron. That's what the other one says. But I'm gonna open this one. Show you the name of it in case I didn't say it right. But anyway, came this bag, the other one didn't. I don't know why, but it's red and it has the name on the back and also the name here, and it has. Um, three six. It has twelve credit card slots, and um, in the middle, just has like the cards and tell you a little about them, about the company, I guess, or whatever. I ain't reading. I'm not finna read it. So. That one and the next one is a Pantone wallet. And I got this one because it had spikes on it and I thought it was cute. And this is it. And then come in the bag. I don't know why. But it didn't bother me and it has the little red. This reminds me of a little hill. And it doesn't have the logo on the outside or on the zipper. But I'm gonna open it and it has the same amount of pockets. Then you can put your cash here, cash here, here or here. Then you can put your change or whatever in here. And then just the same thing that was in the other one. Oh, those are the tags. Uh, what it is and what it costs so yeah that's it and I'm going to show you one more thing that I got which is a purse and um, a wallet like I said this stuff this came in from Left something out, okay. They, it was a little card in the box, which I never even saw till I just looked down. And a little envelope. And I guess this is my receipt. Yep, this is my invoice receipt. Stuff like that. Another card. 
policy. So, yeah, this this. And I'm going to show you guys one more thing that I got. And this is a, a Prada bag. And wallet. Bag and I ordered this offline from Naaman and this is just some stuff that came in a box some more stuff to get you to spend more money same thing and this is just my receipt and return policy telling me what I bought and This ammo person came this dust bag and it's black and it has gold hardware trimming for the zipper and it has a little pocket on the outside. That you slide and open and it's just a little pocket you could drop your keys or something. And this is the inside of it. And then, like I said, it's made out of calf skin. It's pretty. And it has snaps right there. You can open it and make more space if you want to. If you have to. And on the inside, it has one zip pocket on this side. And it has a drop pocket without a zip that you can just drop your phone, anything in. And on this side has two more pockets and has two zip compartments. And there's no pockets on those. So I'm content with the pockets that it has on the inside right here. And it has top handles as well as a strap that you can take off right here so I haven't worn this purse oh and it has feet on the bottom so I have not worn this purse yet at the moment because I haven't been here and plus I just don't want to wear it right now and this is the wallet and it's um a portfolio lampoo Safiano it's the same thing as the purse, but it came in this box right here, but it's um, pink, I think. And this one wrapped in this. And this is what it looks like. And it zips around all the way around, except for the bottom. And it has 12 slots as well. And you can put cash here, here there or here and has a little zip in the middle and a cord okay the cord just tells you what it is and your certificate of authenticity I guess yeah, that's what it is. So, I guess I'll keep this and put it up somewhere. And that's it, you guys. I'll come back to show you this, what I've been talking lately. I've been talking this bag, which is a Gucci Soho red. And if you guys want any more details on this, and how it looks on the inside then I will let you know and I got the wallet and I've been told this um, Versace crossbody these are the two bags that I've been told so I put my other purses up because I'm in love with this crossbody and if you guys want any more details on this then just feel free to let me know I went in the Versace store in North Park Mall in Dallas and got this 
in the Gucci store. I know Pop Mall and got this. So, like I said, if you guys got any questions or you want to see details on this or that, just feel free to let me know. I'm just trying to get some of this stuff out the way so I can take it and put it up. I don't want to put it up until I showed you guys. So, um, I ain't been buying stuff lately. So, I mean, like people that's been subscribing to me for a long time. Y'all kind of know I ain't been doing nothing lately, so I just went a little crazy, and <laughs> I just went a little crazy and got some stuff and treated myself because I haven't been treating, I haven't treated myself in like three or four or five years, so I just, I just went out and did some and did some shopping and damaging. Yeah, half of the stuff I probably don't even use. But yeah, anyway, like I said, if you guys want any specs or details on anything that I've shown you, just feel free to let me know. And I love you guys. And I still got y'all packages back here. Just don't know what to do yet. So, you guys are open for ideals. So, please feel free to let me know and say something down below. And I'm going to... I'm sitting on the stuff, so I'm just going to pick out something else and throw in there. Maybe a wallet or something. So, yeah. I'll talk to you guys later, and I love you all. And I hope you guys enjoy these videos. And I'm going to try to do more videos. I know I always say that. Y'all probably be like, bullshit, girl. But I'm for real this time. I just have to take care of my grandmother. And she in Louisiana, and I'm in Texas. And it's kind of hard trying to do that and keep up with my YouTube and stuff like that. So... Yeah, I hope you guys understand. And like I said, all my real people that's been sticking around for the longest, I appreciate it. I love